it's been a little while since we had our last video log, but I was sitting down to have lunch a little late in the day and it just seemed like the opportune moment because we had the right ingredients. I oftentimes will have a, like a peanut butter sandwich for lunch and so I was thinking they're getting ready to have it and it made me think about the conundrum that we face all the time, pretty much every day with clients asking us about LiDAR versus photogrammetry. We have peanut butter, jelly, and we have peanut butter and jelly. Just a lot of the same kind of thing. We have LiDAR, we have photogrammetry, we have LiDAR and photogrammetry. Some people say we should take them all together, which would be peanut butter and jelly, and others want to do them separately. There's advantages and disadvantages to both. And that's what we want to look at today, just really quickly. Now, do I have any credibility in what I'm going to talk to about? I am a photogrammetrist, I am a land surveyor. I've done photogrammetry for basically my whole life and surveying as well. Yes, I use imagery and yes, I use LiDAR. I don't really favor one or the other. Okay, so the question we get asked all the time is, should we capture LiDAR together with the imagery or separately and how can you do it separately? I mean, do you have to make a peanut butter sandwich that starts with peanut butter and jelly together in the same thing if you want them? And the answer is no, you don't. The reason you would be forced into doing LiDAR and imagery together is if that was the only option you had. If the vendor only sells a system that uses LiDAR and imagery together and is inseparable, then you have no choice. You have to take what you have and that's the way it is. There's nothing wrong with that unless you want to fly a greater distance. A lot of times you don't need imagery, so why would you fly imagery? Why would you be capturing the data? Why do you want to drag the extra cameras along during the collection? It reduces your flight time. It's a particularly expensive operation on a UAV. You don't have to do them together. The thing is, a lot of people ask, okay, so I'm halfway through my peanut butter sandwich and now I want jelly. The question is here is, I did my job with LiDAR, client only said he wanted a LiDAR, and I decided I want to add imagery, or the client decided they wanted to add imagery. You can do that at a later time. You can add the imagery and they can fuse together. As all you gotta do is have them share a common coordinate system. And we can overlay the LiDAR with the imagery Fuse them, colorize, whatever you want to do. Many people think you cannot fuse the data together unless they're flown at the same time. That is untrue. It doesn't matter. Temporally, it can be separated by minutes, hours, days, weeks, months, even years. It's all about the data fusion. It's all about the coordinate system that brings them together. Use a system that's the most appropriate for the job. So I'm gonna get back to my lunch here in a minute, but I just wanna let you know again, don't have to put everything together. We have a very nice system at LiDAR USA. We have a LiDAR system with a variety of scanners, variety of INS, makes a nice little package, fits on a variety of UAVs. It can have a camera, not have a camera, it's up to you. We have options for a single little super lightweight camera, 60 degree field of view, just bolts onto the back here. Or we can go for a bigger system. Uh, this gives you a larger field of view, it's two 60 degree cameras put together in 110 degree field of view. Again, just pull it down to the back. Now we're covering 110 degree field of view, gives us a wider swath. But we can have other cameras on back as well. We can have Sony's, we can even do a phase one. But the key is, we let you mix and match our stuff. Backpack, UAV, car, railroad, boat, whatever you wanna do. Uh, we know not everybody wants a peanut butter jelly sandwich. Sometimes you want just peanut butter, sometimes you want just jelly. We give you that choice. Visit us at LiDARUSA.com. Drop us an email, sales at LiDARUSA.com. Give us a call. We'd be glad to talk to you. We'd be glad to set you up with the system. We hope you learned something from this and uh, hope you drop back again soon. Thanks.